What's up guys? Today I'm going to show you my infinite bite farm in Astroneer. I posted a video on this before, but since then it's kind of become obsolete. I designed a new farm here and I'm going to show you how it works and how I built it. So first thing you want to consider is the planet you're going to build this on. The best planet to do this on is Aatrox, but I know that a lot of you probably aren't to that stage in the game yet where you're going to build something there. The two next best planets are going to be Glacio and Kalidor. So you want to start off with an extra large platform C and then you'll take four atmospheric condensers and place them on it. Now keep in mind you can use one if you like to. These are going to use 20 power each. So I have an exact number of RTGs here that's going to be able to power it. And you're going to set all of these to produce methane. Alright, so now these are all set to methane. You're going to grab a medium platform A. And you're going to put them like that. And then put an auto arm on each of them. And connect them both to power. And then you're going to need another medium platform with a medium storage. And you're going to take another one of these and you're going to put it in line with that one. And you're going to do the same thing, space the same way this way. So for each one of these atmospheric condensers that you guys are using, you're going to put down three platforms like this. They're sort of close to each other, maybe overlapping a little bit. And they're in the middle of this platform right here. And then you're going to grab two more of these and we'll just stack them this way. And then you're gonna fill these up with research chambers. You can follow these a certain way, it doesn't really matter. And then you're gonna go into each one of these and you're gonna press the green button. Now you're gonna grab another auto arm here. The green circle is gonna be on this middle storage. Same thing with this one. You're gonna have the next one right about there. So you can put another platform between them like that. And we're gonna sort of create a conveyor belt here with these auto arms. And put another storage there. All right, so we got a little bit of methane produced. Let's test it out now. So if you need to, you can move the auto arm up a little bit so it can reach all these. But as you can see, it can reach all four of its research chambers. So this one's good. All right, so you're just gonna repeat this cluster right here and we'll move on to the next group on this side. All right, so it can reach all four of these. We're good on this arm. So it takes two minutes and 30 seconds to research each one of these. And these produce methane once every 50 seconds. So using some math, we're gonna need exactly 12 research chambers, just like that. And we can turn this arm on. Now this setup's using 80 units of power per second. Now what you can do, you can actually double this up and just mirror the factory over on this side. So I'm gonna do that real quick. All right, I finished the second half here. If we just turn these two arms on, I'll show you the system in action here. It'll take a while for it to fully fill up, but once it does, we should have full production. And this may look like a lot of RTGs, and I'll be honest, it is. But on my adventure world, I have like 200 of these, and I could probably make a lot more. But the thing is, I have, I have pretty much automated production of nanocarbon alloy and lithium, so I don't really have to work that hard to get RTGs. So if you want to check out how I did that, I'll leave a link in the description. And I'll do a little time lapse of this thing running. All right, so as you can see, we're making about 30, 140 bytes per second. It doesn't show it in this clip because it's not at full capacity. All right, guys, I hope this helped. If it helped you, please consider dropping a like. I'll be putting out a video shortly on how to make a nanocarbon alloy factory. So stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys in the next video.